100% Chelsea. Chelsea 2, Tottenham 0. It's all right, isn't it? 2-0 win. Chelsea beating Tottenham. Tottenham fans running their mouths before the game, failing miserably. Tottenham YouTubers trying to rub it in on Twitter, losing miserably. Um, George Keeley, I thought about you, mate, you know, saying Wednesday's going to be fun. You, you were right, Wednesday has been fun, uh, especially because we beat you. And, uh, you know, you can't really say anything now because, you know, you, 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 you might show up to the top four, you might do, who knows. You, you've been drawn into it now, uh, you lost to Burnley away, you lost to us uh, at home, and, uh, well, at our, at, away, sorry, as well. And, you know, Kieran Trippier scored the, the, the best goal he scored since that Croatia one. It's a beautiful day, isn't it, mate? But, uh, look, listen. Let's get straight into it. And I'll be honest, I came into this game thinking we were going to get absolutely battered. Um, after what's happened in February and obviously at the end of January as well, you know, we've had Bournemouth, we've had City, we've had United. You know, I was really worried going into this. But then obviously as well, that Carabao Cup final was a good performance. And as I said then, we have to build on it. And we have. We have built on it. And again, it's just a case we have to continue to do that in the rest of these games. But today, you know, we came out, it wasn't a high press, but we were a lot more direct, we were a lot more physical a lot more powerful we really wanted it and it was really clear to see because I thought that today we were we, we, we were at the races and it was something which has always been a worry because obviously we, this season we have been incredibly inconsistent um, again I think stand-up players Rudiger um, was amazing today obviously Kante again box to box amazing stuff Lewis made the point the guy is more than a defensive midfielder He's box to box, he's unreal, his movement, his passing, what he offered today was absolutely amazing. Uh, Mateo Kovacic, I thought he played okay, I think a lot of people were saying he had a really good performance, I thought he did alright, he wasn't amazing, but you know, he, he did the job he was there to do, and um, obviously you know, I thought one player which needs to get a mention after you know, people were getting so a lot of stick is uh, Marcus Alonso. Now Marcus Alonso came into this game, we all saw the lineup. myself included, I, I was not confident based on seeing what I thought was a, a reversion to uh, what we, uh, we've seen previously, where you had Kovacic, you had Marcus Alonso, you had Pedro, you know, you had the, the standard team. And I think it's kind of a case of no one was feeling confident. But Marcus Alonso today, he stepped up to the plate. And I almost think it's because he did have a rest against uh, in, the, in the Carabao Cup final. Maybe he's just feeling a bit more refreshed. Um, but it's kind of a case of he was making those interceptions, he was you know making those key passes, he was running up and down the wing. Yes, he was still a bit slow to get back, and it, but you know I think Tottenham were weren't as physical and didn't have as much prowess as they could have done down that side uh, today. And you know for me, I just thought was it was an all-round um, great performance from Chelsea. We weren't amazing, but we got the job done. We ground it out, which is it's really important um, for me. Sorry, got it all right today. Um, and to be honest, if we won with the lineup he selected, obviously everyone was very critical to begin with. He, he got the job done, and, and that's what's important. I think Ruben Loftus Cheek coming on definitely added another dimension to the play. The same guys for Willian. I think Hazard coming off. A lot of people were shocked by that, but the more you think about it, we have to realise he has played 120 minutes, plus the amount of minutes that he played in this game today. Um, you know, we're probably resting him and getting prepared for Fulham because it is going to be a tough run in before the international break. But look, realistically, we have to keep going. We have to keep grinding out these results. And listen, today, we beat Tottenham Hotspur. What, what, what else is there to say? You know, it's, it's, it's one of the best feelings out there. You know, probably goes for me personally, it goes winning a cup, then beating Tottenham. And, uh, you know, Tottenham fans aren't really sure about what winning a cup is. And yeah, you know, they say we bought it in uh, 2003, but we still won a lot more than you in the 90s. And the last time you were really properly prominent was uh, the 1980s. And to be beaten by what you said was the so called banter club twice in a few weeks, uh, well, says a lot, doesn't it? Tottenham, it's happened again. It's happened again. Tottenham Hotspur, it's happened again. Harry Kane's voodoo magic injury stuff didn't work. Uh, clearly, he was invisible today. You know, he, he tried to run to a, a free ball. You know, I think as a, as a top quarter centre forward, he would know that it wasn't the free ball. And uh, Hyun Min Son, I think he's still at the um, Asia Trophies or whatever it is he was at in, uh, with, uh, with South Korea. Uh, yeah, you know, I, think, I think, you know, it's quite unfortunate for you guys today. But uh, yeah, listen, I don't really care. Look, we beat you lot, fair and square. You're better team today and uh, the best team won. We did the job, what we needed to do. Expressions, George, I mean, we are Tottenham TV, you've already told me they couldn't be here. They had some personal stuff to deal with. That's fine, but George, mate, after the way you ran your mouth, I suppose you didn't turn up. But look, we won today. On to the next game, which is Fulham away. We will obviously be there. And uh, guys, make sure you subscribe to 100% Chelsea. All social media subscription, Facebook, Snapchat, Twitter, and Instagram. A great performance by the team today. We ground it out. Let's take it forward, and we will see you later. Ta-ra.